Oh, okay. Who actually asked for this? Johnny Tess is coming back? Yes, it is. March 15, which is today where I'm recording this, Johnny Tess has been announced to be coming back on Johnny Tess's YouTube channel. The show ended like December 25th, 2014 on Cartoon Network on Cartoon Network, which is not even five years ago yet, but somebody saw it was good, good enough to get a revival. And it's pretty weird now. Johnny Tess is coming back by Wild Green, which actually is the one who copyrights videos of Johnny Tess full episodes, so yeah, Wild Green has a part of this. Also, people on Twitter are getting, like, confused over this. Tons of, tons of po tweets and posts and everything about this new Johnny Test that nobody knew. Nobody knows if it's going to be a reboot or a revival. Nobody knows yet. But all I know is this going to be new and weird. Because Johnny Test is not as bad as people say it is, but who knows? This might actually be good or bad, but... I, I'm I'm just gonna be my my like my prediction is that it's just gonna be another mediocre Johnny Test review so they can have a new generation of kids watching Johnny Test again. My thoughts on this is that it could be good. It it could have potential. Like season one and two on Johnny Test were pretty good. Season three was mediocre. Season four was four to six were mainly bad. So I think it could have potential for a new generation. And what Knuckles is going on, I think it's qu probably going to be on Cartoon Knuckles still. Instead. I mean, people, some people might say it'll be on Netflix because the whole show is on Netflix, but I doubt that. It's probably just going to be on Cartoon Network again. But one of my thoughts on this, why, why Johnny Tess is getting revival? There's so many good shows that could have been revived. So many. You know, Stick It Around should have been revived, but that's just my opinion. It's not that many people know about the show, so it's not as popular enough to get a revival. So, yeah. Also, going on the network thing, some people say since it's being made by Wild Grain, that they no longer make shows for TV and only their YouTube and streaming service. It might only be online only, so it, not, it might not be on Cartoon Network. We don't, but... We don't know yet. This might be an exception, so it might be on Cartoon Network. Because this is a big show. Bigger than a lot of other ones. That Wild Green makes. Well, we don't have that much news about this, so... I'm just going to give this a wrap. In my opinion, it could be good or bad, mediocre, or anything like that. But... I also think that other shows that got the revival treatment, even from Wild Grain, they have some good shows that they had done, or continue, or not canceled some of these shows, because some of these shows was not, they, they weren't that bad, anyway. Toon Marty, like, nobody knows about that yet, but that show wasn't that as bad, and could have stayed instead of getting canceled in 2017. The show didn't even last that long, not even a full year. So, it's just, it's just, why? Why? Not even after half a decade since it got canceled. Why Johnny Tess? Why out of any other show that they have in their catalog that they could have rebooted? Even Caillou could have been good. Even Caillou could have been rebooted or something like that. But no, they chose Johnny Tess to get most people angry or probably and get attention. Because, to be honest, they, nobody would care if they had a Caillou reboot. But they would care if Johnny Tess was coming back. Because Johnny Tess has more of a hate them than a Caillou now. And, no, I'm not kidding. Caillou used to be, like, hated a lot. Like, by everyone. But now nobody cares about Caillou. People moved on to other shows to hate on. And Johnny Tess is one of them. Well, that's my thoughts on this this Johnny Test reboot. Let's just hope it will be better than seasons four to six.